So Spigen sent us a bunch of different cases. Uh, some of them we've seen before, but there's a lot of new ones in here as well. So we're gonna take a quick look at them. So the first one is the Thin Fit Gray Orchid case for the S8. We also have one for the S8 Plus, but we're only gonna check out the S8 today. Um, so I'm gonna open it up. So this is very similar to the Thin Fit case that was my favorite with uh, the other story that we did a little uh, earlier, a couple weeks ago, I think. Um, and it fits, it fits really great on the S8. It's actually a very solid case. Uh, and it's still my favorite. The Thin Fit line that Spigen makes are, are some of the best around. And then we're gonna check out the next one if I can get this off. So the next case um, that we're gonna take a look at is the Neo Hybrid Crystal. So this one is a little softer than what I typically prefer out of a smartphone case. It's a little rubbery. I, I always say that these are kind of harder to fit into my pocket. But the thing that's different about uh, Spigen's Neo Hybrids is that it has this sort of, I guess, metallic, uh, I guess, rim around it what, is what you could call it. And that makes it a little easier to slide into your pocket. So I'll pop it in to show what it looks like. Um, it's actually pretty nice, I'm surprised. And I, and I like the, the blue coloring around it too. Matches uh, pretty well with the phone. So we'll take that one back off. And then the next one that we have is the Tough Armor case. And I had one of these for an HTC M8 a couple years ago, and I liked it, but it's also really bulky. Um, it does have kind of a neat little kickstand that snaps out like that. And it's, it's, it's gonna protect the crap out of your phone. Um, it is really big though, it adds a lot of bulk to the S8. But that said, you can also pop it down like this with the kickstand, which is kind of nice. Uh, especially if you're the type of person that watches a lot of videos, that's kind of cool. Um, but this one's definitely not for me because I like cell phone cases that are sleeker and don't add a lot of bulk to the device. Um, and then the final one that we have here, and I would say that this one is probably a little, uh, little niche. I don't know if this is something that I would ever recommend to someone, um, but it is, it is out there. So for example, you can pop open the side of this one. It's called the Slim Armor CS. You slide open the side and that's where, uh, I guess the idea is that you put credit cards and other cards inside here. So it's if you want to ditch your wallet and maybe carry just your smartphone around, which freaks me out a little bit. There's no way that I could ever do that. Um, so we'll pop it on so just so you can see what it looks like. But it's, it's very similar to the, the Tough Armor case. There's not much of a difference with it at all in any way. It's nearly identical. Um, it's a little bulkier, I guess, on the back. So yeah, th those are the four new cases that we got from Spigen, but we also, and I'm not gonna put this one on, uh, but we got a NeoFlex Premium Optical Full Coverage Film Case. Um, so this is kind of like a screen protector that is a wet application. So it's it's like the, um, if you've ever used Invisible Shield before. A couple years ago, I was really into Invisible Shield. Haven't really used them in a while, uh, but that's what this is. So you got the applicator, of course. Um, and then on top of that, you also have the, the various screen protectors. I haven't tried these out yet. I'm going to, I've never been a big fan of wet application screen protectors, but I mean, that was a couple years ago when I used them before, so I'm willing to give them a shot again. Uh, so yeah, that's Spigen's line of various cases. We have new colors. Um, there's some good ones in there, but as usual, the thin case is my favorite. So thanks a lot for watching. I am Patrick O'Rourke for Mobile Syrup.